Hi, my name is Tevin Imlock from Guyana, and we keep in Batman. How did you develop your passion for cricket, and who were your biggest influences growing up? Uh, a lot of time, a lot of years. Uh, I, I, it all started at home, you know, in my neighborhood in, in um, Sapphire. Um, cricket was a big, big part of, you know, growing up. A lot of the older guys, you know, on the streets playing and whatnot, and you know, it's something that you know I got into. Uh, had to get, uh, had to be tough, you know, playing around those guys, and you know, I think that's where the, my love for the game started. Which aspect of your game do you consider to be your greatest strength? And how have you worked on that skill throughout your career? Uh, uh, that would be my batting. Um, you know, coming up, coming up at the Denmark Club, you know, you have a lot of experienced players. Uh, Roger Harper, also my coach, um, Gavin Ned, you know, he was very instrumental in, you know, my development as a batter. Um, so, yeah, it, it, you know, most of my batting and stuff, you know, in terms of development, you know, came from there. Can you share a memorable moment or achievement from your cricket journey that you are particularly proud of? <laughs> the under 19 World Cup that we won, uh, that, that run out was a major part of, you know, a lot of people say that, you know, that was a major part of us winning the game. So, um, yeah, that's, that's probably the highlight for me. How do you maintain your focus and motivation during challenging times, both on and off the field? Oh. And that's difficult, but it's, it's just believing in yourself, believing that, you know, you belong. You know, obviously, you, you've had success playing, so, you know, you go back to those memories, those times when you had that success, and, you know, that give you that belief again. As a cricketer, what goals and aspirations do you have for your future, both personally and for the teams that you represent? Well, obviously, with teams, is is ours to win cricket games, as much game as possible, and as a as a player is contributing you know obviously the the main objective as any cricketer is to play for West Indies represent West Indies you know to the best of their ability and for me that, that that's the main objective if you could assemble a dream cricket team with players from any era who would be your top three picks Sir Viv Shivnarine Chandrapal Light, light. Which cricket stadium, anywhere in the world, would you love to play in the most, and why? No, it's home of cricket. Simple as that. If you were to compete in a reality-based um, type show, but with cricket involved, which fellow cricketers would you choose as your teammates? Three of them. Uh, Probably Leon Johnson, you know, a leadership quality. Um, Sachin Tendulkar, I'm very cool. What do you miss most when you're away from home? Family. Share a memorable off-field moment with your teammates from any team that you played um, with that you believe captures the spirit of camaraderie in that team. Uh, there, there are some traditions in, in Ghana um, that you, know, you don't necessarily want to you know, come on and say, but you know, it, it, it forms a bond as a, as a team. So, yeah. If you were to design a signature cricket shot named after you, what would it look like and how would it be executed? Uh, probably back of the bat scoop. So, <laughs> you turn the bat backwards and try to hit it. Just come out of the back. 